today I'm going to explain alveol reaction and Kanizar reaction. Alveol reaction and uh, Kanizar reaction. Now, for a dual reaction, at least one alpha hydrogen is required. Aldehydes, it can be aldehyde or ketone, any aldehyde or ketone having alpha hydrogen. This is the functional group, and the carbon atom attached to the functional group is alpha carbon atom. So this is alpha hydrogen. For example, this is another aldehyde. Here also one alpha hydrogen is there. So aldol reaction will occur here. Here, if <coughs> I take this example, formaldehyde. Here, no alpha carbon atom is there, so there will be no alpha hydrogen, so no aldol reaction will occur in this carbonyl compound. In Kenizaro reaction, there must not be alpha hydrogen. For example, this formaldehyde, it does not contain any alpha hydrogen, so Kenizaro reaction will occur. This is benzaldehyde. In benzaldehyde, also no alpha hydrogen is there, so Kanizar reaction will occur here also. So now, first of all, for aldol reaction, we can take any aldehyde or ketone having at least one alpha hydrogen. So I am taking this example. acetaldehyde this is an aldehyde having alpha hydrogen if it is reacted with a base then beta hydroxyaldehyde beta hydroxyaldehyde is formed now <coughs> see products you among the common even have a trick to is okay see the idea to be hydrogen see when I'm a car is when put a video I do got see another molecule Amala viro, same aldi hai to get to aldi hai yau dabani na. This is also ester aldi hai. This is also ester aldi hai. So, sigi si alpha. This is alpha carbon atom. Sigi hydrogen si na. Si da ida. Ado ga sigi bond si na. Si da shift hola pa. Ado ga si carbon si ga si carbon si ga ni sigi marat si da double bond same. Ado ga this O becomes OH. This is the trick to write the beta hydroxy aldehyde or ketone. This is alpha, this is beta, beta carbon atom. I give my means beta hydroxy aldehyde. Now I pack nomenclature the one, two, three. 3 hydroxy butane null carbon. I am taking another example of ketone for a low reaction. This is a ketone in which alpha hydrogen is there. So if it is reacted with a base 
This base can be sodium hydroxide, potassium hydroxide, or sodium bicarbonate. Sodium bicarbonate or carbonate. Potassium carbonate we can take also. So commonly sodium hydroxide is taken here. So how <coughs> we write the product directly without the mechanism? Still later. Sigi C H three C Makada Putabiro Sumaina Aduga Sugumbaza mana molecular ma poina say that irony by showing the alpha hydrogen this is the alpha hydrogen say hydrogen in the city ship the viro by bonum say that ship the hollow aduga equina palmiba product to say the EBR this O becomes OH CHC makhadas when put over and we see carbon see carbon see and you see mark the bottom of the same say the hydrogen and the lady hydrogen and then this C O C S 3 this is again alpha this carbon atom is beta beta the O is the pay then beta hydroxy ketone tie I pick now nomenclature of this compound is 1 2 3 4 4 hydroxy 4 methyl pentane 2 on this is the product now <clears throat> in this case actually two molecules of the aldehyde or ketone is are taken one of them x is nucleophile and another one acts as electrophile so which molecule is acting as nucleophile that is very easy the molecule in uh, whose alpha hydrogen is used that molecule will act as nucleophile now I am writing the mechanism of this reaction mechanism The alpha hydrogen is acidic in nature going to base a we base to OH minus ion iron OH minus ion sina see hydrogen see alpha hydrogen by the own song that I'm at the abstract over here. See base, see now, see hydrogen is abstract over there. See electron and see carbon is the lehore. See is the hydrogen and the CH2 minus. And then it becomes this anion. This is called enolate ion. Plus water is there. Now this is enolate ion because this is stable. This is the reason why this hydrogen is acidic in nature because after removing this hydrogen, the anion form <coughs> is stable due to resonance. This ion is called in all inolate ion this is inolate ion inolate ion this inolate ion acts as nucleophile in this reaction now <coughs> the next step is this inolate ion x nucleophile x as nucleophile to attack to another molecule of the aldehyde or ketone here we are taking ketone this carbon atom has deficiency of electron because it is attached to a more electronegative oxygen atom so this excess nucleophile here is nucleophile this bone breaks now it becomes ch3 c o minus so in this carbon atom this CH2 will be attached CH2 this 
CS3 will be here and C double bond O CH3. Now this O minus ion abstracts one hydrogen from water as base and uh, the product will be I'm writing here CH3 C OH this will be CH3 and uh, this is CH2 C double bond O CH3 this is the mechanism now this is alpha carbon atom because CO is attached and to disk the carbon atom attached to alpha carbon atom is called beta carbon atom this is beta hydroxy ketone now in aldol condensation this beta hydroxy aldehyde or ketone is heated and uh, <clears throat> water molecule removes OH from beta carbon atom and hydrogen from alpha carbon atom and we get an alpha beta unsaturated aldehyde or ketone that is aldol condensation I am writing one example of aldol, aldol condensation here by taking another example in aldol condensation alpha, alpha beta unsaturated aldehyde is formed for example if I take this aldehyde and the condition is base with heat so we get this product this is alpha this is beta alpha beta unsaturated and the form this is aldol condensation product now how to write this product without mechanism is here write this aldehyde this is O this is hydrogen this is propanol and uh, use another molecule of the same molecule same compound by showing alpha carbon atom close to carbonyl group of the another molecule this is the alpha carbon atom see the ch3c economic hardest when it's in the ev the c double bond o h now after this we just remove this water molecule this is h2 water molecule removes and c and this c and it's again mark the double bond and form the here we get the product this is a lot condensation product and this is the trick to write the product without mechanism next reaction is Kenizaro reaction in Kenizaro reaction there must be no alpha hydrogen Kenizaro reaction now here we take one aldehyde having no alpha hydrogen it is reacted with a strong base now in this case one carboxylic ion and one alcohol of the same carbon atom same number of carbon atom is produced now how this here one carbon atom is here two molecule will be used this carboxylate ion also contains one carbon atom this alcohol also contains one carbon atom now how to write the mechanism of this reaction mechanism this is the aldehyde having no alpha hydrogen 
OH minus ion from this base acts as nucleophile here, as nucleophile, not as base here. In a low reaction, OH minus ion acts as base, but in Kenizaro reaction, OH minus ion acts as nucleophile. This bond is broken. This becomes OH minus ion here, OH. Now, this can abstract one hydrogen from water molecule to give di all, but that is not stable. So, in, to simplify the mechanism, we can write here this O minus ion becomes CO. These two electrons will form a pi bond here and the hydride ion, this hydride ion. Both electrons will go out. Hydride ion leaves and it will attack another molecule of the aldehyde as nucleophile, as nucleophile. What is the nucleophile here? Hydride ion. This hydride ion X shifting of hydride ion as nucleophile takes place in Kenizaro reaction. This will break and we will have here C, this will be O, this hydrogen goes out and uh, OH is here. Hi, see the hydrogen is in a hydride ion, or in a, see carbon is the nucleophile on a ectoroga, see the carbon is the hydrogen is in a lie, see the hydrogen is in a See the lysy, see O is in a minus sign. Since our medium is basic in nature, this carboxylic acid reacts, reacts with base to form carboxylate ion. And this minus ion will abstract one hydrogen from water as base to form CH3OH, CH3OH, these are the products, this and uh, this, carboxylate ion and uh, alcohol. Now in cross Kenizaro reaction, we can take two aldehydes, two different aldehydes. Now if we take two different aldehydes, here, for example, formaldehyde and uh, benzaldehyde. Benzaldehyde also has no alpha hydrogen, and if it is reacted with strong base, now what will be the product? What will be the products? Carboxylate ion do formate ion oigatra or natraganum benzoate ion oigatra this is the question here for that we need to check we need to know the mechanism in the first step OH minus ion attacks as nucleophile so sigi anis the equina karamba the nucleophile attack to be like the have the yang and ever have the sigi benzyl dehyde the c or the attack to bumadam the OH minus ion and nucleophile or not Benzene group, a sober group, a label in a OH minus ion, a benzyl dehyde, the nucleophile, and a tech to see, Luga never formal dehyde to any to never. So, format ion will be formed. Sigi steps the Chedum Saman receive over Sigi steps the format ion, you know, say the formal dehyde, you know, the canalani, Sigi, benzyl dehyde, the lane ever. Benzyl dehyde, the lacun, and the Sigi hydrogen, Sigi the Gata Kari or any. Benzene line, see the form to the sumina, see the benzyl alcohol form to the high with the without showing the mechanism. I am writing the products only here. Format ion will be formed along with benzyl alcohol. Remember this alcohol and uh, 
Oh, this is correct. This alcohol must contain the same number of carbon atoms with this aldehyde. Benzene plus one carbon atom, benzene plus one carbon atom. Here it is one carbon atom, so the formaldehyde contains one carbon atom only.